Are you tired of being codependent? Have you ever wondered why you're always cheating? Huh? Why do you have to always mother everyone you date? I understand. The biggest problem usually is people choose the wrong person. Are you ready to find out the truth? Uh, yes. In just one video, you'll understand what you're looking for in love and what you offer. You send us your date of birth, we send you a custom video that's all about you. We call it Secrets of Birthdays, the love and lust report. Find out your birthday secrets today, available online at secretsofbirthdays.com. Hello officers, Gabriel. Welcome back from the weekend. Thanks for logging in. Well, sunny, professional, and sharp today for the Scorpions. The moon is in Leo, putting emotional focus on your career. Plus, the moon is the ruling state of awareness. So emotions are ruling us today. We're more emotional than we normally are. In your case, that emotional focus is on career and legacy. And over the course of the day, the moon crosses over Mercury. So I predict Scorpios will get to some sort of emotional clarity, how they really feel about some aspect of their career legacy. Now remember, legacy means anything you leave behind on the planet, your spiritual work, your life's work. So this can include your baseball collection, this can include your bottle caps, you know, this can include your children, whatever it is you leave behind, scrapbooks, etc. You'll get emotionally clear today, I think, on what, how you really feel. And this is what you're gonna be working on in just 10 days when the sun hops over. Now speaking of the sun, we're in chapter three of sun in Cancer. We had a very powerful weekend, a total eclipse of the sun on Sunday. That was light cast day as well. Major booster shot for Scorpios to invest in what they really believe, okay? Maybe you are opposing what you've been raised to believe. Maybe you're opposing your religion. Maybe you're just believing in yourself for the first time. Whatever it is you came to in the last 24 hours, keep it going. Okay, and today you might want to compare what you believe in and how that relates to your emotions around your career because the two are kind of connected with the sun being ruled by the moon today. And Uranus, Uranus is retrograde. It has been retrograde for about a week, but retrograde means that uh, our inner rebel is gonna come out now. Okay, retrograde means we move inner with the lessons and Uranus is the rebel, right? It's a big bad wolf of the zodiac. So your inner rebel is gonna come out between now and August 13th when it comes to your feelings about your lifestyle, okay? So if you really feel trapped by your job, you may want to rebel. If you feel really trapped about your body, be careful, you may want to rebel, okay? You don't wanna to go too far, especially if you're a person that ever uses any kind of a substance. So between now and August 13th, listen to your inner rebel, get to know yourself, be honest with yourself. Remember, since it is in Aries, it is tied to your strength and will. And it's Monday. We have Julie Zipper's meditation vibration coming back today. This is her chapter four question answer episode in Cancer. I recommend you check out Julie because whether you posted a question or someone else, she's always got fascinating information in this fourth chapter. So she's live everywhere, Soul Garden Streams. Well, that wraps up Monday already. Went by quick, didn't it? But tomorrow, Venus in Virgo, hopping over the border. That means that you're going to be really fertile when it comes to finding new friends. Those details and more in just 24, Scorpio. Live, love, be. So good.